I welcome each of you to this, our Black Mass for Poland. Witam was, and hail Satan! Hail Satan! We light these candles to invoke Lucifer, the light bringer. Hail Lucifer! Hail Lucifer! As Satanists, we hold the autonomy of body and mind to be of highest importance. Our second pillar states that we should respect the inviolable body, autonomous will, and sovereign right of every individual to guide their own life and being. Remembering that enjoyment of these rights is predicated on respect for the same in others. We are pained to hear the news of lesbian, bisexual, gay, trans, queer, and other people being attacked and arrested in Poland, merely for expressing themselves with their persecutors often using religion as an excuse for their bigotry. It is here we feel our need to express our opposition through our religion, through our Satanism, to show that we are against these acts of oppression, to show our support to those being persecuted, and to show that whilst awful things are being done in the name of their god, we can do beautiful things in the name of Satan. We invoke the names of Hell to aid us. We take up the name of Belial to show our friends true worth and that they are free from any yoke. We take up the name of Behemoth to confound our enemies and block their way. We take up the name of Lilith to inspire our friends and to embrace the metaphorical mother of all rebellion. We take up the name of Beelzebub to lift up our friends and protect them from their plight. We take up the name of Babylon, mother of prostitutes and so-called abominations of the earth to reclaim the narrative from our enemies. We take up the name of Satan to show wrath to our enemies to disarm them in their use of the Demiurge to hurt others. We take up the name of Lucifer to encourage pride in our friends and to make them unafraid of showing who they truly are. Shivatio ponad ignorancia, miłość ponad nienawiść. Hail Satan! We now celebrate the gift of knowledge and awareness over lies and ignorance. When Satan, in the garden, led Eve to the tree of knowledge, he said to her, Why then was this forbid? Why but to awe? Why, but to keep ye low and ignorant? His worshippers, he knows that in the day ye eat thereof. Your eyes that seem so clear, yet are but dim, shall perfectly be then opened and cleared, and ye shall be as gods, knowing both good and evil as they know. Let us then be as gods, let us partake of the fruit of knowledge, let us be subservient to none, Hail Satan! Hail Satan! We have
have invoked the names of hell to stand with our friends and against our enemies. We have partaken of the Feast of Enlightenment to celebrate the victory of wisdom and knowledge over bigotry and lies. Our Black Mass is drawing to a close. We finish with a final invocation. We stand now against the forces of ignorance, bigotry, and hatred. Unfettered and unbowed by arcane doctrine born of fearful minds in unenlightened times. We follow the satanic impulse to eat freely from the tree of knowledge. We revel in our freedom from societal norms. And we share this knowledge and these freedoms with those who would accept them gladly. That which will not bend must break, and that which can be destroyed by truth should never be spared its demise. It is done. Hail Satan! Hail Satan!